It's Thursday, April 9th, 2009. This is the Morning Swim Show brought to you by Tier. Thanks for joining us. I'm your host, Peter Bush. Today, we have one of the most accomplished master swimmers in history waiting in the wings. Laura Val will join us to talk about being named as one of Swimming World Magazine's Master Swimmers of the Year. But we'll start with the world record that was set, or tied rather, today at the Chinese Nationals. Zhao Jing tied the women's long course meters 50 backstroke record with a 27.67. Australia's Sophie Eddington did the same time last year. And speaking of ties, let's get to some other exciting news from the YMCA Nationals, which are taking place right now in Fort Lauderdale. More than 1,600 kids aged 12 to 18 are swimming at the meet. So far, dozens of meet records have fallen. Many of those meet records have stood since the early 90s. In the team race, Sarasota Family YMCA is winning the combined race over Middle Tiger YMCA, 580 points to 451 and a half. Middle Tiger is winning the women's meet, Sarasota the men's. But the biggest battle in the pool right now is taking place in the women's sprint freestyles between Emily Lloyd, a 16-year-old from Ann Arundel Y, which is in Maryland, and Margot Gear, a 17-year-old from Springfield Y in Ohio. The two tied in the finals of the 50 free on Monday, but Lloyd was disqualified after the race for a false start, so Gear got the win and the meet record at 22.68. Now, fast forward to Wednesday night. This is the matchup between the two teenagers in the 100 freestyle. Swim Network's down there right now providing on-demand footage of the finals, and they captured a doozy in this one. Gear is closer to your screen in lane four. She took the race out hard. At one point, had about a half a body length lead, but Lloyd came roaring back on that last 50. Here's the end of the race call by Olympic gold medalists Mel Stewart and Josh Davis. Very quick, can she get Stephanie Williams' record, 10-year-old, 11-year-old record, 49.2? Emily Lloyd, they turn together. Got two 14-year-olds in the field. Again, but Emily Lloyd saying down off the wall, and it looks like Margot Gears in the lead. What a here great comes Lloyd. Battle. Lloyd. Lloyd's challenging her. Both girls with the head down. Who gets it? Well, it's Emily Lloyd and a new YMCA national record. They tied. They tied. They did it again. They tied. <laughs> they both share the record. Wow. <laughs> Emily Lloyd, 49.02. Margot Gear, 49.02. They did the same thing in the 50. Emily Lloyd disqualified, loses it. Emily, I, I, don't, I wonder how satisfying that is the second oh, time. What are the odds that they tie in the 50 and tie in the 100? Now they share the record. What a race. That's great stuff. Thank you very much to Swim, Net Swim Network excuse me, for providing the footage. Both ladies, as you saw, 4902. That's a new YMCA national record. You can catch all the finals from Fort Lauderdale at Swim Network's website, swimnetwork.com. In other news, Dara Torres is back in the news. On Tuesday, Torres featured on NBC Nightly News the same day that her new book, Age is Just a Number, was released. Now the five-time Olympian's giving away one of her diet secrets in a new ad campaign. Apparently, milk is one of the reasons that the 41-year-old mother, still looking good, still able to compete on the world stage in the 50 free. In the new ad campaign, Torres says that milk is one of her secret weapons in her post-exercise diet. The ad, according to the Why Milk Initiative, aims to get more women to understand the importance of proper nutrition and exercise, which helps build muscles and enhance recovery. Speaking of swimming fast as you get older, we've had a lot of Masters world records broken in the past couple weeks. Lois Kivy Nachman, who you may remember, was a guest on our show last month, a darn good guest at that. She set two more short course meters world records in the 85 to 89 age group at a meet in Michigan just three weeks ago to bring her total up to six for the year. Her new records came in the 400 IM at 10 minutes, 28 seconds, and point. Oh, five seconds, excuse me, and the 50 fly in 101.73. A lowest broke their 400 IM record by 27 seconds. At the same meet, Kevin Doak reset his own world record in the 100 back with a 55.26 in the 25-29 age group. In Ohio, Todd Stoltz, Laura Kessler, Jack Russell, and Karen Starsky set a new short course meters record in the mixed 200 free relay for the 200 plus age group with a 148.74. Grissel set an individual world record of his own in the meet, 54.50 in the 100 free for the 55 to 59 age group. We're gonna keep this Masters theme going after we return on the Morning Swim Show, take a quick break, 
And then a 57-year-old who's breaking records practically every time she races will join us.